So what? Howdy! My name is Danny and today we're checking out this new cannon which is called Vacuum Garbage Cannon. Or Vacuum Rubbish Cannon if you're English or Aussie. It's the same model I once made in our previous workshop, but it has few upgrades. The ones we made before were also pretty powerful. I'm pretty sure there are videos somewhere on my Russian channel. And here we've added a propelling nozzle. It has a special cross section of this cube block which helps to accelerate the air coming in from this side and shoot it out of here with even greater satanic speed. I'm also going to assemble that mighty machine. We connect the vacuum air pump here. It's going to suck out the air from the main chamber from the barrel of our cannon. If I could connect it. Piece of shit, connect already. Next, what we have is a specially solid vacuum foil. It's called Frickin' Buck. <laughs> we we'll stick it in here, it's going to be one of the two membranes. A bit later I'll tell you what are they for. This membrane is going to hold the vacuum when we'll be pumping out the air from the main chamber. On the end of the cannon we have another similar membrane. Of course I'm going to show you how to put it on. Right now I want to apply some electrical tape, because everything here is held together with spit, chewing gum and blue tape, as usual. Let's add some more tape. Classic blue. And on the end we have to make a little bump, kinda like a flanged pipe, so the hose could be connected to all that crap. So one end goes in here, that's cool. And the other we connect here. There are not too many ways to go. When shooting, before reloading, this membrane would get shot through and we'll have to assemble reassemble it. Well, that's a gun we've got. And the most interesting part, which makes this cannon almighty, is our little excess pressure tank. Unfortunately, with that uh, pretty shitty compressor, well, it's already fucked up because it's older than your dad and no one took care of it and it has been abused like a drunken chick at the frat party, it will pump up the pressure in this tank. Just four atmospheres. Just but it's fucking crazy. Actually, this cannon, when we were making just the, the muzzle loading type, it was shooting like a freaking beast. What are we going to have now with four atmospheres? I cannot even imagine. Now, what measuring devices do we have to check the pressure with here and there? We have a vacuum gauge from 0 to 100. We are going to pump it up to almost 100, then we'll use the compressor. In that tank, it'll shoot through this membrane with the pressure here we'll have vacuum and we'll shoot out the ball with some crazy speed. Our ammo consists of seven ping pong balls and one wooden bullet called... That's fucked up. Alex. Also the caliber of this barrel lets us shoot with, um, I don't remember, I guess, two inch polypropylene plugs. Let's charge it. ASMR foil. Ow, my iron tooth! So, we put a usual ping pong ball into a barrel. Check this out, like right into a pocket. Nope, the air won't let me do it. Had to go fucking around before sticking the membrane in. Okay, we put this shit up, the air comes out of the cracks, maybe the tube is not proper enough, but it's see-through. The ball is in, now we have to cover up the front hole of the barrel. Let's tape it up properly so there won't be any gaps. Now we strap up all the crap and can start shooting actually. Hmm? Before having all the fun, I'd rather put my glasses on because, well, hell knows that shit's real. Okay, the pump. Come on, it's having a hard time. Are you having a hard time? This pump is a pussy. That's what I'm talking about. Fuck! Well, the membrane out of foil isn't right. At least not frickin' bock. The foil doesn't stick in. We also have a cooking plastic wrap. Should be stronger. I'd like to recommend some membranes, what materials you should use, like what density, gram per cubic centimeter should be there, but I don't know shit. The empiricism. The best way to solve your problems, I suppose. Here we go, the tires are on fire, and we have the vacuum up to a hundred.
Yep, we have the vacuum. Let's add some pressure. Oh, ho, 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 ho. the ball is fucked up, but the carton, I mean the plywood, doesn't give a fuck. Maybe we should move it closer, almost back to back. Okay, okay. But now we have to change everything. If you... If you haven't subscribed to our channel... Oh, you hush now. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, I think it's about time to do it. Considering I'm assembling such awesome stuff here, like this video, now it's really important and helps a lot. Thank you very much. Let's go. Already a hundred. Fuck me sideways. Shit, didn't go through. Something is wrong. Either everything is fucked up or this thing. Maybe the cross section is wrong and there are many obstacles. But to have more fun, I think we should move on to this dude. Here we can use a stronger target like this piece of shit. I need something longer, something longer. By the way, the fiberglass rebar, the one we use for glass bowl limbs, it's gonna be rad. Vacuum is about on 100. Here comes the compressor. It's cut in two, come on, freaking awesome. So how's the bullet? The bullet seems to be fine. Scrotty paid us a visit. He says he wants to get a taste of a ping pong ball. We loaded it with a ping pong ball and we have a double membrane for excessive pressure. Let's check it out. Let's fucking go! Whoa! That seems to be much stronger. Squatty seems to be pretty solid. The arrows shoot him through. But what about a wooden bullet? So I like the double membrane. Let's get on with it. A double membrane and a wooden bullet versus Squatty. The vacuum is on. <laughs> well, not so fucking destructive, but actually his mug is fucking strong. Squatty, you have a splitter on your jaw. Well, his mouth is bashed in. I'd like to make another shot with the bullet. Where is it? The bullet has taken the shape of his lips. Awesome, bashed in. A double membrane, a wooden bullet and Squatty's torso. Come on, come on, come on! Give me a hundred! Yeah, let's go! One atmosphere. 1.5. Two. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa, holy shit, what was it? Fuck me, next time we have to put some, like, shields in here. Man, he was shot through. He shot him right through and flew to the fucking window. Here's the exit wound. He's really fucking hole-proof. And here's the glass fiber, the two layers separated from each other, and the glass piece of shit behind. Let's make some more thrash. Like this video, subscribe to our channel. It was Danny Krester. Fuck, we have a broken window, though. That's shitty. Well gonna go make something more fucked up.